Hey racing fans, let's relieve the moment when Reaper returned to Street Outlaws after a devastating accident in 2020. Drag racing is a hard sport to give up because there is so much to love about it, and racers will constantly try to find an excuse to return. James Goode, a Street Outlaws star and better known as Reaper on the popular reality series, lost both of his cameras in a terrible trailer fire last year. Due to the agony the experience caused, Goad mentally distanced himself from racing after losing everything, and he had no intention of doing again. Posting on Facebook, James wrote, Early this morning on our way back from Texas, the stacker caught on fire, he explained. Sadly, Reaper and the orange car were in it. This is all that is left of them. At the moment, we are still trying to process all of this. The post did not specify the precise location or the cause of the fire. He described how the fire broke out as he was returning from a race at Extreme Raceway Park in Ferris, Texas, and the devastation was extensive. The estimated cost of the fire's damage, even with insurance, is $200,000. Nevertheless, he made a comeback on the Street Outlaws No Prep Kings circuit as a result of support from his followers friends, and family. Goad wasn't intending to go back to no prep racing after the fire because he had been spending his time working on other vehicles in his shop. However, as the chorus of support from the public grew too loud, he began to reconsider that decision. He said, The fans I've gained over the years are just awesome. I got so many messages on social media from fans telling me I needed to make a comeback after the fire. My Facebook and YouTube page were just flooded with people offering support. I couldn't turn my back on them. Stacy, Goad's wife, also nagged him to return to the racing game. She didn't like him while he was on the 405 program. But she wanted to see Goad come back to NPK and win an event because he never had the chance to do so before the fire. One of the things I've always lacked is the trifecta that teams like Ryan Martin Robin Roberts and others have a good car, a good team, and a semi-good driver. The driver is the least important part of the equation. I've had Nick Bruder tuning my cars for a while, and when I had Nick and his brother Rich both helping me, we almost won at Bristol. Tyree Smith is good at what he does, and he's going to be a big help. Now I'll be able to interact with the fans more. He will take care of the car and hand me my driver's suit when I need to clock into work, Good said. That's it for this video. If you like the content, like our video, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for notifications.